guys, Cole McMath here with Turn Off Road. Uh, we're going to be going over some of the feature, features and benefits of our uh, slider steps, uh, which we affectionately call the Stider. Um, we're going to be going over entry and exit with these things. We're going to be going over how they're mounted to the vehicle and then how much deflection there is when the full weight of the vehicle is placed on these. And uh, we're going to do that with the forklift. So to get started, uh, entry and exit we have some raised pieces of metal uh, welded onto the top here and there's about a four inch uh, step to assist you in getting into the vehicle um, this really helps keep people from stepping on you know your little painted area here which is really their only option if you don't have some sort of step um, so i'll just kind of show you getting in and out pretty simple Now these do sit higher than a conventional step. You're probably used to a step sitting about right here. You know, they hang lower, they look a little gaudy, but they do provide for a little bit more to, of a, a drop down for you to be able to get your foot in there and get up. So these are a compromise between a step and a slider. We really built the slider first uh, and the step component second because we value the protection of the vehicle over and above the step functionality. But these do a good job of capturing both. Um, so now we're going to go under the vehicle and take a look at how it's mounted so you can see uh, just how strong it is. Hey guys, we're now under the Bronco and we're going to take a look at our mounting points here. There are three mounting points underneath the vehicle. Um, each one has a quarter inch bracket that bolts to the body mount and, uh, or the uh, factory step bolt holes um, and then uh, this the Stider has a boxed uh, casing that basically slides over that and then it not only bolts to the bolts here but it also bolts through the pinch weld which adds a lot of stability and it cuts off this distance here that you would have if you just came underneath it um, so that makes the, the unit a lot stronger we also have these dimple die uh, plating uh, these work great to reduce weight and they also uh, slide off of rocks really well with the dimple die design because it's really hard for anything to get into there. Um, we found this to be the most rigid way you could mount a slider without uh, mounting it to the frame. Um, and in a lot of instances, we found these to be actually stronger than frame mounted sliders. So uh, very strong units. Uh, we're going to show you a little bit how strong they are in just a minute. We're going to lift uh, this side of the Bronco up with the forklift. Um, we're looking to get out on the, on the trails and get some footage out there, but uh, generally when we're out there, we're having too much fun to really think about uh, stopping to take a video. So next time we're out, we'll be sure to get a video for you guys. But for now, you can see the minimal deflection when the vehicle's lifted up by the forklift. And uh, it really is quite impressive for a body mounted slider. Well guys, that's it for this video. If you uh, have any questions or want to know anything else about this product, be sure to leave us uh, a message in the comments or give us a call or shoot us an email at info at turnoffroad.com. Thanks.